Hi, welcome back to Gray is Gorgeous. Um, I just wanted to do a quick update on the Morphe setting spray for you. Um, I apologize that I didn't immediately put it in my description box, my results at the end of the day. And I also wanted to let you know that after I got done filming and like the next day or next time I used it, I felt like it was like spraying cologne on my face. So when I was doing the video, when you're doing a video, you get a little bit distracted by doing the video and the content of the video. But at, when I was, you know, using it again, I thought this is just like spraying cologne on your face. And it's really, I wouldn't recommend it. Um, also, uh, the price, you know, I looked back at my receipt and it was $12. It was $12 for the travel size. So, I would not buy the Morphe Continuous Mist. I did like the mist. That's the only thing I liked about it. As far as it holding my makeup, I don't feel like it did anything. It didn't leave my face t sticky or tacky or anything like that. But it also didn't produce any results like, oh, wow, it really held my makeup on or anything like that. Now, I, I just to be frank with you, I don't normally have a problem with my makeup not lasting and if if it starts you know the oils start to come through I generally dust with powder but I don't normally do that midday I just let my makeup do whatever it's going to do but um, I did I do feel like the wet and wild one is better it's just a bummer that the sprayer on that isn't isn't that great but I did want to let you know this is a fail and I wouldn't buy it and you know I Anyway, just wanted to let you know that, and um, yeah, I'm going to go in and return it now. So thank you so much for watching. Um, so that's my update on the spray, and um, click subscribe if you'd like to see more of my videos. Click like if you like the content of this video, and we'll catch you next time. Bye for now.